to lead to the long answer, I'll give you the short answer, which is this. They bought into the Kool-Aid. They understood what I was saying. They were willing to run through walls, dive through tables, wrap themselves up in barbed wire, set themselves on fire, then go into the crowd while on fire, wrapped up in barbed wire, <laughs> bleeding with beer all over them, go up to the balcony, dive off the balcony through another human being, waiting for them to dive on top of them, lying on a table as they came off a 20-foot balcony and crash them through the floor because, and here it is, short answer, I really believed in all of them. And that's the short answer to it. My, my job in ECW was to find an artist. If you were in this business and you viewed this business as an art, and you wanted to ply your trade as an artist, most of the people in hiring positions back at that time in this business didn't want you. It just wasn't the hiring process. The hiring process was to be six foot five, 300 pounds, be like Zeus. Remember Zeus, Tiny Lister? Remember Zeus? Oh, you, listen, I laughed too about it, but Zeus, Zeus was the typical, that's it, we want that, we want Zeus. Zeus comes in, he's six foot five, you're 300 pounds, WWE superstar, that's it. WCW, they wanted something else. They wanted, oh, he, well, he played college football, he played college basketball, he's an athlete. Oh, he has athletic credentials, sign him. We want athletes. We want Bill Freilich. We want, and, and listen, and, and, and that mentality led them to finding Goldberg. WWE didn't recruit Goldberg. WCW recruited Goldberg. So let's give them a little credit on searching for athletes. It, apply, it does apply today. I think you need athletes who are showmen, of which Goldberg was, and there were a lot of athletes that didn't make it in WCW, but that was one that did. But that's what they wanted, athletes. College football, college basketball. Scott was going to try out for the Atlanta Braves. He's 260 pounds. Let's bring him in. WWE wanted six foot five, 300 pounds. I wanted everybody else. I wanted people that they didn't want. And I'd say to the person, why don't they want you? I'm five foot eight. Okay. So you're five foot eight. What else? Well, I'm five foot eight and uh, I don't have really any athletic credentials. Right? And, and I, I can't wear stilts in the ring, so they're not going to hire me. Okay. Can you wrestle? Yes. What can you do? I can out-wrestle anybody that you have in your locker room. Hmm. How? Because I'm, I'm an amateur wrestler. I just didn't go for any titles. But I also know judo. I know Kempo Karate. I'm studying this kind of new, new age fighting called uh, 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 Brazilian Jiu Jitsu. Oh, what else can you do? I can choke any <laughs> you got here out. <laughs> oh. So, what's your name? Pete. I am a, but, but what do they call you? Well, they call me Taz. Right. 